Freeborn Talent Show, Death Defying Stunts, take one. Thank you. Next. Next. My peanut butter sandwich. Kids, don't try this at home. If you ask me, there's no better way to spend a beautiful sunny summer day than vegging out in front of the TV. Um, excuse me, do you mind? My living room is definitely a no pogo zone. Wait, what's going on? Could it be? World Book of Records. When's the deadline? Today. Haven't you seen the posters? They're all over Freeborn. I got it. I got it. Maybe we should bake the pancakes before we toss them, Eugene. Hey, Loyal. Trying to get into the Wacky World Book of Records? Why not? One wacky accomplishment and the whole world gets to read about it. This book already weighs a ton. I don't know if there are any crazy ideas left to do. Hey! Watch out, guys! Your earwax statue is melting! That sounds familiar. Yep. Hey, guys! Sorry, that earwax statue thing's been done. A monkey pyramid over a body of water. I bet you nobody's ever thought of this before. The pièce de résistance. I can scale that pyramid. We're in the record books for sure. <laughs> Superior architectural skills, my friends. Feast your eyes on an engineering marvel. Sorry, Dodo, but that's being done. Someone built a monkey pyramid across the Mississippi River. What? <laughs> This is gonna be a lot more painful than it looks. Okay, uh, how about flying Elvises? Eh, been done. Both the early and later Elvis. Who knew just finding an idea would be so tough? How about catapulting someone wearing a head cam so we can broadcast live over the internet? That's brutal. Who could we use? Elvis Melvis, Flying Tito's. Hmm. My masterstroke. And they said art school wouldn't pay off. Beautiful angle. Don nuts. There goes the money shot. Have I been out in the sun too long, or is it about to start raining Tito's? No wonder Picasso had a blue period. Still, this pulp might make for decent muffins. You did it, Pop. The world's largest board game. And it could double as a tennis court. <laughs> uh, keep the change. Hey, you just drove over my checkerboard. So, king me. <laughs> J.B. Weasel, East Coast representative of the Wacky World Book of Records at your service. Why does it have your previous job title scratched out? Uh, moving up in the world, son. But you just destroyed my entry. Mmm, that's no good. No good at all. Look, you still have time to throw something else together. After all, remember, the world reads wacky. Come on, son. We've got work to do. Tell your friends, tell everyone. Remember, fame and fortune follow our winners like a bad smell. What's that I hear? ka -ching? The sound of my bank account growing. <laughs> <gasps> oh, yeah! Has the local 
official rep of the Wacky World book, I'm here as a sort of cheerleader. And I want to see every last one of you exhaust yourselves trying to get into the book! Yeah! Yeah! I'm in a bit of a hurry because I'm on the run. I mean, I have to run. So I'll expect you all back here with your entries in an hour. An hour? Get out of my Honey, way! No way! You stepped on my foot! Say, Pop, do you find anything suspicious about Weasel's behavior? I sure do, son. He wears funny clothes for someone who calls himself a cheerleader. Truly an elephant with my enormous capacity needs no help to break a silly world record. A balloon Eiffel Tower? Hmm, how French! Eiffel Tower? It's supposed to be a bunny! Does this look anything like a bunny? It's all in the attention to detail. Voila! The Beatles! Each on the head of a different pin. My bunny! No! Ah! Ah! Ringo! Ah! Where have you gone? I would feel very encouraged if I were you, my little friend. I look forward to seeing you and all your friends later. You will be there, won't you? Ringo Star? Okay. Quadruple somersault, triple spin, half tuck into a glass of water. Oops! Forgot to bring a witness! Hey, what's going on back there? I hope you're preparing for the wacky competition. Forget the record book. Do you guys need a manager? This 69-year hiccup run is one of my favorites. Interesting, kid. Listen, shouldn't you be running around like the others? You want to be in the book, don't you? And gargling the national anthem with a mouthful of goldfish is also quite impressive. What's your favorite record, Mr. Weasel? My record? My record's bogus. I was framed. <clears throat> Never mind. J.B. Weasel's not the Wacky World Book of Records East Coast representative? I can't tell you how pleased I am to see everyone here. Who knew you were all so... Competitive? Hungry for fame? Gullible. I mean, so enthusiastic! Yay! <laughs> and what are you supposed to be? The world's biggest mime. I think I'm caught in the zipper. Say hi to Mr. Weasel, Socky. Behold, the Notre Dame Cathedral, made entirely out of toothpicks. Fine, great, whatever. Now, there's just the matter of the entry fee. Oh, oh he's he's talking talking about money. Money. About money. How much is this entry fee? To see your name in the coolest publication in the universe? How much you got? No. Wait! J.B. Weasel is not who he says he is. He's a sham, a huckster, and a con artist. He say that like they're bad things. Wacky World Book just told me they don't charge an entry fee. Call me! So that's 
why wow. Weasel was trying to get everyone to come. I can't believe you were the only one who saw through his scam. It's like I said, Pop. Something smelt funny. <laughs> and it still does. Anyone care for one of my rutabaga muffins? So, how does it taste? Hmm, bitterly avant-garde. Yeah, with a touch too much postmodernism. Could use a little butter. Freeborn talent show, artistic expression. Take one. Thank you. Next. Next. 